Al Gol, the hero king, lies defeated at the feet of Darth Vader, the Sith Lord who has claimed both Soul Calibur and Soul Edge. With these legendary weapons in his possession, he has returned to the Empire, ready to unleash their combined power upon the galaxy. But who will be brave enough or foolish enough to stand against him? The fate of the universe now rests in the hands of a few chosen warriors. Find out next time on Soul Calibur 4 as the epic battle between good and evil continues. Yoda, having emerged victorious over the Hero King, watched as he disappeared into the Ethereal Realm leaving both Soul Calibur and Soul Edge behind. This was but a momentary respite in the ongoing struggle against the Empire. The wise Jedi Master must now forge ahead, seeking the path towards ultimate victory. Can Yoda find a way to vanquish the Empire once and for all? Tune in next time on Soul Calibur 4 as the epic saga continues. Now that the Apprentice has slain Algo, the essence of both Soul Edge and Soul Calibur has been absorbed within him. But now, it is time for the ultimate showdown as the Apprentice prepares to face his former master, Darth Vader. The fate of the galaxy hangs in the balance. Who will emerge victorious? Stay tuned for the next action-packed episode of Soul Calibur 4! After enduring the trials of reclaiming his tainted soul, Lizard Man has at last emerged victorious over the Astro Knight's nightmare. As the cursed blade Soul Edge releases his essence, a newfound light shines within him. But one cannot help but wonder what fresh turmoil will the evil Lizard Man now unleash upon the world? Stay tuned for the next thrilling episode of Soul Calibur 4! There is no longer any need for Sophitia to seek the destruction of Soul Calibur, now that her fears for her daughter have been vanquished. With newfound hope in her heart, she returns home. But what about Cassandra? Will she arrive in time to save her from the clutches of darkness? The fate of the two sisters now rests in the hands of destiny. Stay tuned for the next thrilling installment of Soul Calibur 4. With the new world crafted by Raphael, Will Amy find it in her heart to forgive him for the murder of his own servants? Tune in next time to find out! Revenge and hatred had consumed Sesago's heart for far too long, has now been laid to rest in the grave beneath the silent snowfall of Japan. As if symbolically marking her journey towards inner peace, an umbrella has been left in memorial. A final offering to her ancestors and a testament to her ability to let go of the past and move on. Algo, vanquished by the samurai Heishiro Mizuruki. Yet one wonders, will he rise again? Stay tuned to find out. With a strength that remains shrouded in mystery, Cassandra effortlessly shatters both Soul Calibur and Soul Edge. In that moment, the fate of the two sisters finally comes to an end. With the new world now in existence, one can't help but wonder how Amy will react when she witnesses Raphael her father mercilessly slaughtering his own servants. Will her unwavering love and devotion be strong enough to forget such an atrocity? The answer lies in the pages to come, as the tale unfolds with each passing day.
With talkie vanished from the annals of history, the question remains. Will Siegfried ever muster the courage to confront his inner demons? Only time would tell. Until then, stay tuned for the next thrilling installment of Soul Calibur 4. Unleashing the full force of Soul Calibur, Siegfried crystallizes both Soul Edge and Nightmare's very being, as well as his own. The world around them is soon engulfed in a sparkling display, as if a utopia of peace and harmony, free from war and suffering, has begun to materialize. Yet the question remains. Can Siegfried break free from this crystallized prison? Find out next time when you take control of Helda in the thrilling continuation of your journey in the next episode of Soul Calibur 4. With Siegfried defeated yet still alive, one must wonder who will stand against Nightmare. The stage is set for another thrilling installment of Soul Calibur 4. Stay tuned for the next captivating episode as the saga unfolds. Now, at long last, Siegfried has been granted absolution and found redemption through the selflessness of Hilda. His tale, one of trial and turmoil, has drawn to a close. If Maxi were to overcome the formidable Astaroth, using the corruptive might of Soul Edge, will this be enough for him to break free from the clutches of evil? Or would such a victory only serve to further entangle him in the darkness? Stay tuned to the next thrilling episode of Soul Calibur 4 to find out. Fetergy's voice echoes in his mind. A reminder from his master not to be foolish. He knows that Bodo will never have willingly given his soul to the cursed sword Soul Edge. The soldiers and thieves never stand a chance as Bodo swiftly eliminates them one by one. With a final bow, he pays his respects to the cursed sword before turning away, leaving the scene behind him. Nightmare, the embodiment of evil and the master of Solage, met his final fate, and with it, the cursed sword vanished from existence along with him. However, before Nightmare's spirits could fully depart, he entrusted his loyal servant, Tira, to continue his work. As if a heavy burden was lifted, the essence of Nightmare left her, illuminating her with a newfound sense of purpose. Sean Wah's heartfelt words reach Killick as he returns her embrace, their bond stronger than ever. With the loss of Solage, they stand united, their love the only thing that can bring happiness to Killick's troubled soul. Thank you, Sean Wah. Both the power of Soul Calibur and that of Soul Edge reside within Killick's weapon, Kali Yuga. He is determined to harness this might, even if it means wielding it without succumbing to the darkness of evil. His roar echoes across the jungle, singling the dawn of the Dark Ages. Astaroth, now towering in the massive monstrous lava giant form, strides fearlessly through the tangled undergrowth, 
But will he be able to collect more souls before he shrinks back to his normal size? His evil quest continues next time on Soul Calibur 4. Death is not an option for Ivy. Her sword, an extension of her fairy soul, protects her in the most desperate of moments. The crystals now shattered into a thousand gleaming fragments, yet it is her sword that saves her. Now, her new life begins, forged from the bond she has broken with Soul Edge, the cursed sword. Yon Son's eyes widen as he comprehended the weight of Son Mina's words. He had them blinded by the allure of Soul Edge's power, believing it could protect his homeland and the people he cared for. But now, he realized that there was something far more precious than power, something he had been searching for all along. Will Son Mina's final lesson be enough to save Yon Son from the clutches of Soul Edge? Stay tuned for the next exciting installment of Soul Calibur 4! Rock, the heroic warrior, had at last defeated the nefarious Algol, the Hero King. As he gazed upon the verdant land that held his beloved son, Bangu, a sense of profound peace and condiment washed over him. He knew that this is where they both belong, in nature's embrace. Who will stand in the way of Cervantes now that he has ascended to the realm of the gods? Find out in our next thrilling episode of Soul Calibur 4. With Chalim's selfless act of kindness, Algol has been reunited with his son, Octaurus, who has been restored to life. The two swords and their rightful owners are now returned to their true forms, bound together by an unbreakable bond. Knowing that the true evil lies within Algol's weapons but not himself, Yoshimisu decides to spare the sword's wielder. His selfless act of mercy, driven by his unyielding desire to protect the weak, is a testament to his enduring spirit, one that echoes through the annals of time and continues to inspire generations. Sasalamel has been reborn as a successful billionaire in the bustling city of Los Angeles in the United States during the 21st century. His immortal soul shall guide humanity for eternity, guiding them towards progress and enlightenment. With Al Gol's rebirth, he has been granted a new body and immense power. Yet even so, he is unable to undo the events of his past. As the new ruler of this world, he believes that true kinship entails forsaking the luxury of dwelling upon the past. Instead, Algo resolves to forge an eternal reign that will never fade away.